Now is the time for vendors and trusted partners to keep supporting clients to the best of their abilities and with lots of empathy. I think as, as fleet professionals, uh, supervision's approach has been, you know, to be empathetic, to, to, to learn during this time from our, from our peers and from our customers and, and even sometimes from our competitors in the, in the event that we're all in this together um, and we all need each other from this time. So, you know, taking the approach of, of listening to our customers and really understanding where their challenges are, um, as simple as it is to say that it's a tough economy, each, each customer, each um, business, each market vertical out there is being impacted differently um, from, a financially, from a financial standpoint. And in some cases, just from being able to maintain a, a strong workforce, um, you know, being on the front lines and, and, and facing the health issues that they're facing, um, they tend to take over what, what may be um, different than what you're providing as a core uh, solution for them. And so how do we, as, as professionals and as support mechanisms, um, learn how to continue to support them, you know, maybe in different ways and taking some of that day-to-day -day burden off of their hands so that they can focus on, you know, the health of their employees, the health of their business, um, how they're going to, you know, different strategies that they need to make on the fly right now to accommodate certain requirements and regulations to do their jobs. Um, our role, I believe, as, as a vendor and, and a trusted partner is to kind of pitch relief. So everybody, everybody grab a shovel mentality and let's step into the front lines and help them where they need it. So they can do what they do the best and we can work through this and, and enjoy the next phase after the pandemic.